Hello and welcome to The Mailates. My name is Ankita and today I will be giving you guys a brief overview about uh, what is The Mailates and how it can help you in your business and how to use the software. So Domilis is a lead generation platform, so it's a great lead generation tool for B2B sales and marketing. Uh, whoever has recently registered their domains, you can get their details just by conducting a simple search. So if you provide graphic design services, or if you provide marketing services, or if you're into you know, web development, like providing web development services, so it's a great lead generation tool. Um, you can just go in and you can conduct a simple search based on your criteria, and you'll be getting fresh leads every day in your life. So if you need leads, I am, I'm pretty sure every business needs leads. So if you need leads, it's a great lead generation tool, and Domini can help you with that. So now when you know that how it can benefit you, how it can help you, so I'm just gonna go in and give you guys a brief, you know, overview, inside overview, how you can use the software and how like how it can help you. So I'm just gonna log in with my login credentials. Um, so just a minute. So I'm just gonna go in, yeah, I'm just I'm just in right now and uh, just after I log in, I will be getting, I'll be getting this, I'll be seeing this page and uh, I'll have a little profile section here. So as you can see, I, I have a little profile section here. So I can just uh, go in and edit my profile information, like, you know, my name, my last name, and I can update that. I can change my password if I want to. I can change my, I can update my payment information and I can see which membership I am uh, right now in. So right now I am under basic membership, um, which you have, so where I can have like 50 leads, I can unlock 50 leads a day. So this is a 47 bucks per month and then we have 97 bucks a month where you can get 500 leads a day. And then we have 197 bucks a month where you can have like, you can unlock unlimited leads per day. So yeah, it's um, it's really a like great lead generation platform as you can see. Like for anyone who has just bought a domain or whose you know domain is going to be expired in the, uh, in the near thirty days, like in the next thirty days. So you are gonna get their like get their details. So just gonna go in and show you how you can achieve that. So. Here I have two options, uh, newly registered domains and as you can see, as you can see to be expired domains. So I can just select a date range. Um, today is 22nd, so I'm just gonna select uh, 19th, suppose, and I'm gonna select suppose 20. So uh, this is a domain name. So if you want uh, any particular keyword um, to be uh, like, you know, to be inside your domain, so you can give that and I'm leaving it blank for now. And then there, here are all the TLDs. So uh, I can choose any TLDs as many as I want. So I'm just gonna choose uh, .com for now. Yeah, .com and then here I can give a country name. So I'm just gonna go ahead, I'm gonna give United States. And here you can give states and uh, the zip code. I'm gonna leave it blank for now. And then I'm gonna just uh, click on search. So I'm gonna, I, I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna get a great result set. Get, uh, okay, here you go. We have 3,631 leads against my search. So I can unlock as many as I want. I have a limit of 50. So as you can see, I just unlocked this one and I got these details. Uh, so I can unlock this and I can this, unlock this. So I have unlocked four leads uh, so far and you can see this count is increasing uh, as, uh, as I'm going uh, through. So uh, here I get all these details. So here's the domain name, uh, suggestion2020.com and then I get the registered name and email, their email ID they have, that they have registered with, their phone, their contact details, either it's a landline or either it's a mobile number. So this one is a mobile number, this one is a landline. So yeah, I get that and then I get their get a created date and expiry date and I get the registered like the company they are registered with. So this I can see that bigs.com uh, is limited is the registered company name. So I can see that. So here you get um, all this like 10, 20, 50 per page or 100 per page. So you can select any of that option and it will be filtered by that. 
Uh, so here I have uh, these two options also as well. Uh, so this is basically how many domain leads user has unlocked this particular domain. So if you see this one, that means one domain lead user has unlocked this particular domain. Here this count tells you how many domains this particular user has bought so far. So if you see this count is one, that means this particular user has bought only one domain so far. As you can see this one, um, he has bought three domains. So if I click on here, um, I'll be getting three of the domains that this particular user has bought and then I can unlock. As I can see this and there is all the information. So I can see that. So I just unlock all of the three that this particular user has uh, recently registered or recently bought. So I'm just gonna go back. So here I uh, So I can unlock as many as I want, as I told you, like until I reach my limit, obviously. So uh, I have to this kind, this uh, options as well, like where I can refine my search. Uh, so I can see this domain count. So basically, this count tells you how many, like, uh, how many, like, how many domains a particular user uh, owns. So I, if I want, uh, you can select like greater than. Suppose I can give greater than three. So if I give greater than three, so it will show me the results where the user has mini, the user has bought minimum three domains. So if I go ahead and I can I apply the filter, so I'll be getting the results where I will be seeing at least uh, the user has bought, yeah, see, I guess it's minimum three domains, I, as I told you. So I get this, uh, which uh, this particular user has bought 15 domains. So if I click on here, and then again, I will be redirect to the page where I will be seeing all those 15 domains that this particular user has bought. So I can define my search in a more deeper way. Uh, so here I can get a domain unlocked. So his, this is basically the how many domain list user has, uh, you know, unlocked that unlocked particular unlocked a particular domain. So if I select uh, suppose greater than uh, or maybe equals to one and I apply my filter then I'll be getting results where um, I'll be seeing uh, this particular count where I see uh, this particular count is one so basically at this one domain list user has unlocked this particular domain so I can see I can define my search in that way as well so here I can show I can sort and then here I can ch choose uh, any I'm just gonna go back and then gonna show you. So I'm just gonna go in and do the do this one. So this is for more for number type. So you can just filter by mobile or landline. So if you filter by mobile and you will be getting the, the results which has only mobile numbers. There you go. So I see if I go and unlock. So I'll be seeing only the mobile, like only mobile numbers. So, so basically, the, this user has given, like, has given their mobile number. So I have their contact details now. So um, this is very, this is, as you can see, it's very simple to use. Um, so here are um, all your unlock leads. Like if I go in and go in and click here, so I'll be getting all the unlock leads so far. Like, um, like I have unlocked. So as you can see, I have unlocked 137 domains still there. So I can uh, feature by today's date, like I the domains that I have just unlocked today. So I can select 22nd and I can just feature it, and then I'll be getting the domains that I just have unlocked. So which is 14 domains, and I can see all these domains, and I can download the CSV. If I download the CSV, I'll, it will be downloaded and in uh, CSV or in Excel format, and you can just use, you can just upload it anywhere, and you can use it as you want it to use. So, yeah, here we go. As you can see, their mobile numbers, are all the details, their email ID, first name, last name, website, their domains, all the details that I was just seeing in the website, I got it in the Excel format, in the CSV format. So, um, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the other option, like what was the other option, which was to be expired domains. So now remember, this is only for like near, in the near 30 days. Whoever's domains is going to be expired in the near next 30 days, so you are gonna get all those domains. So I'm gonna get I'm gonna go ahead and select a date range. Um, 
suppose twenty uh, third. I'm not gonna select a one month entrance because it's gonna give me a huge, uh, you know, huge result set, and it's gonna take some time because it's gonna so go and search through at least like millions of you know database. So I'm not gonna do that. So I'm just gonna go ahead and give uh, like twenty four like one day entrance, and this time um, just for year referral, I'm gonna give a keyword um, maybe money. Okay, so not gonna select any TLDs this time. I'm just gonna give United States as well, and maybe this, I'm gonna leave this blank. So as you can see, that I have given money, so which means I'm gonna get uh, the domains, which is gonna contain the keyword money in somewhere in the domain name. If you're really looking for leads in any any particular niche, then uh, you can use this filtration criteria where you give a particular keyword like you know realtor or money or technology, and you will get the domains that has uh, that content that particular keyword, and you will get the results for that. So as I, as you can see, I just got 103 leads. Um, so and please remember, I gave uh, you know like to be expired, don't like to be expired soon. So all these domains I gave a difference between 23rd to 24th. So you can see this all is going to be expired on 24th. And I got the results, which is going, which is going to create, like, going to contain money in anywhere in that domain name. So if I unlock more, you will be able to see that each domain is gonna contain the keyword money in somewhere in the domain name. So here is, here you can see money. Here you can see money. So if I unlock more, I'll be seeing the same thing, money. So and at the same time, you you are obviously seeing this that. Um, these all are going to be expired within that day range. I have, I think I have gone through all the options uh, for you. I have uh, shown you everything uh, through the platform and I'm going to just go ahead and also going through the support. So we have a great support and if you click on support, if you have any anything like in your mind that you are not understanding or if you have any questions, you can always reach support just by clicking that support icon. So just after clicking on the support icon, you will be coming to this page basically, and you can you can just reach support just by clicking on this. So you have to log into your Facebook, and then you can just reach support, and someone from our team will be there to help you. So uh, as well as uh, at the same time, you can actually do any feature requests. So if you have anything in your mind that you think would be very useful for for you and for the other people, so you can just put it as a feature request. And if you see that it actually has some value and it can be like it can be useful, so we will just build it for you. So as you can see, just um, this one just came some days before only that uh, would be amazing to search by registrant company many times a domain doesn't match the type of business. And it got seven outputs, so that means people have really voted for it. So if we like if it's a if it's if we see that yeah, this feature is can be useful, so we will just build it for you. So now when you understand um, almost everything about domain list, I'm just gonna go ahead and sum it up for you. So as I've just after logging, you will be redirected to this page where you will have two options, newly registered domains and to be expired domains. So you can just search by anything that you want. You can search by any, you can give any date range that you want. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and this, and then I'm just gonna do that. I'll give a state, like give a country name, and I'm gonna go ahead and search my domains. Here we go. Uh, so I got 5,754 leads. That's a huge result set. Like, you know, if, if you really, if you're really looking for leads, that's a real, that's really a huge result set. So you can go ahead and unlock anything that you want. And remember, as because I have 50 per leads, so 50 per day, so I can only unlock 50 leads per day for under this plan. So you can upgrade anytime, you can downgrade anytime. So if I go ahead and upgrade, uh, so I'll be basically getting rid of to the membership page where I can see all these plans that I have. So I have my options to upgrade for 97 bucks where I can unlock 500 leads a day and 197 bucks per month where I can unlock like unlimited leads a day. I can cancel anytime uh, if I want, if that's what you know, if that's what you want, so you can cancel as well so, uh, from the platform. So I'm sure I'm sure I have gone through everything inside the software. So if you're really if you are doing a business and I'm pretty sure that you need leads and we have this whole platform just for you to help you with that. 
So I hope you enjoyed the training and if you still have any questions or anything, you can just always can you can always reach support and we'll be happy to help you.